So for the next three days, we are going to be trying out the $1 billion morning routine. <laughs> this video on Annie Long's channel and then I checked out some other YouTubers who are doing the same video too and I had to say I did really enjoy watching it so I hope you guys will enjoy watching my take on it. If you don't know what the one billion dollar morning routine is it is basically attempting to copy other billionaires morning routines to kind of adapt to a similar lifestyle. I think lifestyles in general are really important so I think it's always good to experiment and change and kind of try out different lifestyles just to see what works best for you in the long run. So that's exactly what I am going to be doing over the next few days. I've done quite a bit of research on this routine over the past few days and what I found are a series of steps that lead to perfection and feeling productive for the rest of the day. Currently it is Sunday night so the next three days I have school Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday so it would be really interesting to see how I cope for the rest of the day on a school day so I will feedback that across the duration of this video. It is the evening before we begin this challenge and yeah let's just get started. Also guys if you haven't noticed yes I got braces this is not the first time I've had them. Long story short, my teeth shifted throughout the duration of coronavirus, so I had to get them back on again for four months. Okay, I have just come back from dinner at my grandma's, and now I am just gonna run myself a bath and start to kind of wind down and get ready for bed. First step of the routine was to wake up early, so I guess that means going to bed early as well. So I think I'm gonna go to bed around the normal time, which I try and go to bed during a school night, which is 8.30, which honestly to you may seem a little early, but I do wake up at five. <laughs> I'm not sure how to feel about this routine. The research that I've done so far suggests that it may not be the right routine for me. But then again, that's a similar thing that happened with the 5 a.m. morning routine that I tried a few months ago. And that turned actually to be the right routine for me. Okay, so I'm going to go to bed right now. And I guess I will see you guys in the morning. Bye for now. So right now, because I have just woken up, I now have morning voice, which sounds really weird. So just don't judge. But the first step it says is to recall your dreams. So I'm sitting at my desk right now and I have a scrap piece of paper over here and a pen. And I am just probably going to spend like five to 10 minutes or so recalling my dreams. Apparently billionaires do this to understand themselves and their own visions so i guess we're gonna try it out i've never actually done this before so i'm really interested to see how it goes and the next step is to make our bed this can have a significant contribution to your mindset and allow for a more productive one Next step is to drink water, and by this they mean getting a tall glass of water and drinking all your vitamins and supplements. And this is because everyone gets dehydrated when they sleep, so it's really good to refill yourself with water and rehydrate when you wake up. I drink so much water when I go to sleep, yet I still wake up with a dry throat. So waking up at five, honestly, it seems quite normal for me. I feel quite awake right now. I probably got about seven and a half hours of sleep, which is honestly not bad at all. Okay guys, I have just finished drinking my whole glass of water. I'm feeling very refreshed and rehydrated now. I'm definitely more awake than I was feeling before. So the next step is to actually breathe, which involves meditating in order to clear your mind for the upcoming day. I actually really love meditating, especially first thing in the morning because you're really tired. So throughout online learning in 2020, I meditated every day. 
but now that we have in-person school i kind of stopped it and i would really like to get back into that routine so we're going to try it again now i have the calm app on my phone so i am just going to play maybe like a 10 minute meditation and we're just going to do that Oh yeah, right now it is 5.24, so we have plenty of time before I need to actually go to school. There's this meditation on here that I found called Breathe Into It with Shawn Mendes. I have a ritual that I do before every show. It's kind of like a prayer. I want you to imagine. I kneel down on the ground and I take a guitar pick in my hand and I say, gratitude for music. Next step is to make a move. So it is basically doing two minutes of intensive movement. like jumping jacks or burpees or just anything that will kind of wake you up a bit this can get your heart rate up back to a normal place so let's get started you guys will get to see me exercise set a timer for two minutes <sighs> honestly guys that was not fun i can definitely feel the strength in my body actually definitely more weight but whew, I honestly I couldn't imagine how intense those two minutes would be but that was not fun I did not enjoy it okay are you ready for this the next step is to take a cold shower that's not going to be fun it's a great way to wake yourself up if you're feeling tired and it includes benefits such as resetting your nervous system and reducing inflammation I really don't want to have to do this but it's fine, I guess we have to get on with it. Okay guys, I have just finished my cold shower. That was not fun at all. Luckily, I tried to make it really quick because obviously who would want to be in there for long, but I'm just so glad that I'm out. But unfortunately, that means repeating it for two more days. So now I am just gonna get changed upstairs into my school uniform and then we're gonna go from there okay guys so basically i am all dressed and now we're just gonna get ready and then do the last few steps so let's go i can't turn the light on in the bathroom because it makes a huge sound and also my camera is dying that's great <laughs> step is to journal and i actually have a bunch of journals which i am doing at the moment so i'm just going to carry on with them for about 10 minutes <laughs> And setting these goals allows you to feel accomplished and proud of yourself once you've completed them. And to be honest, I'm really bad at completing to-do lists. I never really use my homework diary for school. I kind of just remember things, which is a really bad way to go about your life. So I need to actually become better at this. And I think this routine will definitely allow me to do that. I'm just gonna write down three goals that I need to complete today. <music> Okay, so the next step, we're actually going to do something really interesting. We are going to write down a to-feel list. I've never actually done this before, but what a to-feel list is, it is basically writing down three emotions that you want to feel that day, and it kind of helps support your mindset in the right direction. So I'm going to do that now, and honestly, just from the sound of it, it sounds really good and motivating. And even at the end of the day, if I don't get this whole routine to be my routine, I still will take Take some elements at least and then the final step is to read it's so beautiful outside today and I think it's like 28 degrees or something crazy like that so I have just finished my reading that was honestly so nice and relaxing now I am beginning to feel quite hungry so I think it's time that we have some breakfast so I was researching on what billionaires have for breakfast 
and honestly lots of the meals were quite diverse and different and I came to the conclusion that for breakfast I am probably just gonna try and see if I can make maybe a smoothie um, and then some toast and some fruit salad so um yeah let's just go downstairs and make it I'm gonna film my iPad Right now I am just packing my bag for school and then I'm going to leave. Okay, so I am all packed and ready for school. To be honest, I'm not sure how I feel about this routine before. This morning was definitely quite calming and relaxing, but I definitely thought it was a bit slow paced and I didn't really get that much done apart from meditating and journaling. There are definitely some elements of this routine that I would like to take into my normal life, but I'm just not sure how I feel about this routine as a whole. There are two more days where I can try this routine out. So let's just see what we have to come. See you guys tomorrow. Good morning everybody, it is officially day two of doing the one billion dollar morning routine. As you can tell, I have just woken up because my voice is all croaky and I look disgusting. <laughs> honestly don't know why but I am so much more tired than I was yesterday. I got about seven hours of sleep which is not that bad but I feel like I should be getting more at my age and making more of an effort to actually go into bed on time. Okay then the next step is to make our beds. It says drink a tall glass of water, so that obviously means to drink quite a lot. So I'm gonna drink way more than I usually do when swallowing tablets. We're gonna do some Calm now, which is my meditating app. Um, I think it's a really good idea to pick up where we left off from the Shawn Mendes meditation, because I really enjoyed that one. Oh my goodness, that was actually so nice. Day after day, I keep on forgetting how important meditation really is, especially with Shawn Mendes. And to be honest, I would really love to include this part of the billion dollar morning routine in my morning routine. Okay, and now for my least favorite part, we have to make a move. <laughs> Two minutes of intense movement, let's go. I'm not enjoying this. Okay, one second. I need a second. That may seem like nothing to you, but those two minutes were the most intense minutes of my life. Definitely feeling more awake now. Day two of taking a really cold shower. So this is not fun at all, but at least cold showers have better things. See you guys after. That was not very nice. I did not enjoy any second of it. It was just really cold, that's the only thing that I could think of. Okay, so we are all changed. Let's go to the bathroom to get ready. to continue this routine then we have to write our journal i'm just gonna carry on with this diary because yeah that's like my number one diary so let's continue for about 10 minutes or so currently it is about 6 30 so we're on good time here 
Now we're gonna make a to-do list and a to-feel list. Okay, and then finally we just have to do some reading. The good thing that I like about this routine, it is it is super chill because mornings can be intense and this is a nice way to prepare yourself. <laughs> members are actually awake right now it is about 6 45 so yeah everyone wakes up pretty late I am just about to leave, but I'm just gonna wrap up this morning here. So I will see you guys for the final morning, which is tomorrow. Bye. Okay, so it is basically Saturday right now. I know what you guys are thinking, Maya, why aren't you filming this on a Tuesday? I actually managed to get really sick throughout this week and I have only just about recovered today. This is very unfortunate, but you know, these things happen in life. So I just wanted to give you guys a little update and just let you guys know what is going on. So I am technically doing this on the weekend, but just to let you guys know, I am still doing this at the same time. So yeah, let's just get on with the final day. I look so crazy right now. I've just rolled out of bed but I can remember correctly the first step was just to recall your dreams okay and then we go make our bed just to show you guys this is what I look like right now not my finest moment and yet I choose to share it on camera but anyway we're just gonna roll with it drunk quite a lot of water so let's just move on to the next activity i have a hint it's meditation sean mendez here we come <laughs> exciting this is my favorite part of the morning my favorite part you just got to have some me time with sean mendez it is the best here it is <laughs> That was amazing. If anything, I kind of feel a bit more sleepy, but never mind. It is honestly such a great way to start your day. So I am suggesting that every single one of you download the Calm app right now and do the Shawn Mendes meditation. Okay, let's just get this next bit over and done with because I am not here for it. Set a timer for two minutes. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Whoa. <sighs> okay, that was heavy. Next. We take a cold shower. Yes, yeah, so today's one of those days where I usually wash my hair. That means I'm gonna have to wash it in the shower. Not gonna be fun at all. And yeah, we're gonna see how we get on with that. I feel like I'm probably not gonna wash it properly though because it would just be so cold. So I'll probably just go like in and out. Okay, that was a nightmare that shower was so so cold and i was in there for like 20 minutes washing my hair to be honest i don't even think i washed my hair like that well because it was honestly so cold and i just wanted to like step out of it as soon as i possibly could after a while i think i got used to it but towards the end it was actually so cold that it actually started hurting and now my face really hurts for some reason so it was interesting trying a cold shower with washing my hair and hate to break it to you but i don't think i would ever actually try that again it was an absolute nightmare definitely feel more right now okay so i have just got changed and here is the OOTD. so it is some super cute jean shorts with a super basic white top um let's get ready and just finish up this video <laughs> I am going to do my makeup off camera because nobody wants to see that boring bit. Okay, let's continue with this routine. Okay, so our to-do list and our to-feel list comes right next. Okay, now, final step. We're gonna go read and then 
have breakfast. This movie looks so good. Okay, that was such a good breakfast. I am 100% feeling more awake and relaxed. I'm just heading upstairs right now to do the outro. Thank you so much guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you wanna see more routine challenges in the future, just like this one and my waking up at 5 a.m. morning routine, please give this video a big thumbs up. Please remember to hit that subscribe button and turn on those post notifications. And all my socials are linked in the description. See you guys next time, bye. Thank you.